breed is called American Fuzzy Lock. Mm -hmm. And the reason this one's kind of my favorite is we've had this breed before it was recognized. The way it was created was um, they wanted to bring the broken pattern into Holland Locks. Oh, okay. And to do that, they introduced another breed for the broken pattern. However, when they did that, it made this wool that was longer than a hollow lot of Out of that became the American Fuzzy Lock. Now it's dilute, so it would take some generations and all of a sudden they'd get this fluffy animal. The reason I like it for even new breeders, if you get the right one, we call it shake and show. And what I mean by that is, is, is you can just pretty much take them out and shake them down and the fur falls back into place. So like an angora where you gotta kind of blow it out and things like that. With the shake and show, you literally shake them and put them back down on the, the so table. So the texture of the fur is a little bit lower maintenance than an angora? Yep, oh absolutely. Okay. They carry their points on their head. They got a nice head. Cute. And their body type. You want a short little cobby animal. Okay. Another breeder said to me today, this is the jewelry. Because that's just the finishing touch on the stuff. The reason it's my favorite breed is because I've had it before it was recognized, which is a very um, time consuming process. We call it a labor of love. So I've been very invested in this breed for a long time. So my biggest point of advice is look around and decide what you like. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, everybody's going to say my breed's the best. <laughs> but if we all pick the same breed, what else would we be doing, right? Do you want to even want a smaller animal than this? And then my second point is talk to breeders. Okay. You know, if you're lucky, it'll be your first breed. <laughs> if you're not, sometimes, you know, mm -hmm. it's like a pair of shoes. You got to wear them, break them in, and decide, is this really my breed or not? Uh-huh. That's awesome. Thank you yes. so much. You're